So I got the chance to go out for a little drive yesterday, and I thought I would take you up a canyon and to a little park where there's some trails, and there looks to be <laughs> signs of melted buildings or something. It's weird. I'll show you. There's, um, there's another place that I found that I know of where I'm going to go there and show you the difference. I don't have that video with me, but I'll keep a piece of this video and I'll put it into the next one that it has the regular rock that's kind of in a similar situation. And you'll be able to see the difference from what regular mountains look like and this stuff, whatever this may be. Um, if you have any comments or anything, appreciate it. Other than that, enjoy the ride. So I found some <clears throat> more potentially melted building areas near me. This one I think is kind of interesting. Got that sheer, interesting, weird flat rock face. Which kind of doesn't make sense if you just think about rocks and dirt. But there's a ton of them over here. I showed you some pictures and that does it just the interesting part it just doesn't fit with the rest of the landscape if you look at the mountains in the background virtually all the mountains in Colorado look like that and then we have these portions that don't there's the backside of that rock does have some distinct crevice lines you can see across it. Sorry about the wind. And then there's interesting little trees interspersed. But somehow these appear to have just been plopped in here or they were something else some time ago. So I'm gonna walk up the trail a little bit. See if I can find you anything interesting to look at. Or something with more definitive. Actually, we'll, I know what we'll do. Okay, stand by. Take a look at this ridge. It goes across. All the way. Some weird, interesting trees interspersed. I suppose they found some soil within those rocks. What's interesting to me about this rock right here, the whole thing actually, are the different lines and their geometry. Hopefully this will come out, but you can see that line falls all the way across and it kind of just keeps going. All the way down to there where we can see that kind of, oh sorry, that kind of reddish hue. Traces itself up. Dang it, right there. So it's not horizontal to the ground, it's angled. And the rest of it that keeps going seems to be the same. I think that's what gives people the idea of not a natural rock formation, but something that was melted. Probably in the Battle of Armageddon, from my perspective. Not sure why most of it was held out west, but western part of the United States, but it was. So, got a little bit more to put in this video. Nothing special. That's about all the rock stuff up here, but there's something else. Just for the heck of it. Pretty nice day though. It's in the 70s. And you can see. <laughs> What did they do to our sun? It's covered. Oh joy. And what's it covered by? Well, those things that people are calling clouds that aren't really clouds. 
these things. See the difference? Of course you do. That's a cloud. That's a chemical spray. Cloud, chemical spray. Clouds, chemical spray. Chemical spray. So, suppose we know who runs this realm right now. In the meantime, we can try to have some fun. Try to discover things, I suppose. I'll be right back. So I thought I'd just give you a ride down the canyon. It's kind of weird to steer and drive and film and I don't have to shift any gears right now though because we're only going 40. Did I tell you I got a, a manual transmission again? Very excited. So, not much going on. It's Monday, so people aren't flooded into the mountains, but just gives you an idea. So, if you make it out to Fatheads and you have a little extra time, uh, let me know. We'll go for a drive. All right, I guess there should be some traffic relatively soon. Traffic, right? Bicycle traffic. Get a decent view of the south part of the metro area. I think I'm just burning batteries now. Nobody's watching anymore. It's loud. Can't hear with the window down. Thanks for watching, love your comments.